So this is this, patio mm -hmm. steps up there. When we go out patio here. Patio up through here, mm -hmm. pond to the right. Well, it almost looks like the ponds are gonna be where those trees are, is the pond? Well, yeah, it'll. it's gonna kind of- Are we gonna do be some logging? Lit over, no, the trees will stay. Oh, okay. Yep, it's gonna come right up against the patio. Gotcha. Now, these stones that are in here, mm -hmm. we need to decide what we're, how we wanna do that. If we wanna take well. and build up or bring them down or, you, want, have some you want pond edge to be at the edge of the patio here? Yeah, fairly close. Oh, or yeah. if we wanted to. No, I think that's the right thing to do. Or, if we, want, or if we wanted to, it could be right behind. We could steal some from down there and finish this out. Just a few more and actually have it elevated. And then well, like steps. So let's go and take a look at it. Mm -hmm. See, one of the things, if, if we if we put pond level and down to this patio, it's going to take some of those. It gives us some more height. It gets element elevation. And I think it would look cool like to have a water right bubble with that. Sure. I don't know. That's a, yeah, no, that's I fine. I can build both. That's fine. I'm, I'm, I'm good with that. Yeah. And so that's what I, I originally was thinking. I was like, well, we could also uh -huh. build it up behind. Yeah. No, I So think we'll I take those it. out and uh -huh. end it with a boulder. Yep. Mm -hmm. Cut it in, dig it back. Mm -hmm. And then maybe our, our patio is slightly elevated because I want to, I've yeah, wanted right. a few steps. Well, we can them. use some of those in a wall here, kind of. Could, something yeah. like that. And then I had three Black Hill steps come yep. up to the patio. So yep. the patio, I want kind of cut into the pond edge, but it could be elevated just a little bit above the pond. Okay, yeah. Um, Fairly cutting. Mm -hmm. I mean, you know what I mean? You still want this and this. Well, yeah, either we mash here or we mash there. Right. I didn't but this could that. be better. This might be look nicer elevated. Yeah. Okay, yep. Yeah, I think you're... Mm -hmm. So we'll bring this one flush with the concrete patio and have this one come in, like, so we can bring some nice big boulders to come up out of the pond mm -hmm. in a few spaces, and then this comes right... Ah, oh, so you're saying have this one above. Elevated, yeah, yeah. yeah. okay. Yeah, because we'll be approximately right. 18 inches if we use three Black Hill yep. steps, some boulders. Oh, yeah. yep. Mm -hmm. And then whatever, like just some really big boulders and a few spots right here. Mm -hmm. They come clear up above and then we'll bring our patio to the back side of it. Mm -hmm. That makes sense, yep. So these boulders would stick maybe 18 inches above water level. Around about, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah sure. No, I think that, that'd be a good idea. This would be kind so of an elevated So you're gonna have to, hand, you're gonna have to this hand pick be... some of your boulders that you want. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So right. this is this is primary view. Right? Yeah. And what you want what the problem? What are I mean, just really this whole thing is nothing but window. Okay. Yeah, right? Exactly. But really, it's going to be kind of. But this is yeah. Okay. I mean, I can. Our mound's gonna. I can get some balls go going that way, so you can see it coming around the well, house. Well, that's what we have 15 by right there. Well, you don't go around the house over there. Oh, you don't. Oh, so gotcha. Over here. Gotcha. Well, yeah. Well, we okay. Can. But this is pri probably primary. Yeah. What you really yeah. wants to be able to like when you come through that door to, and you will see. Yeah. 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 For sure. So, where's the landscape go around here? Just. I uh, will. It'll probably. This would be the. We'll probably kind of come off here. Whatever makes sense. And just like. Yeah. And maybe just a little bit right in mm -hmm. here. Yeah. Yep. Um. Mostly the mounding. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And just in there mm -hmm. a little bit, and then. And then the rest of us gets some kind of seed thrown on it. Wildflower mix. But yeah, it's kind of a cool wall Super here. Cool wall. I like that. So we'll have some pieces to work with we can take out here. Yeah. How we want to take? Yeah. How we lay it out? Oh, look these at that nice moss. Boulder. Look at that. Look at the moss going on there. Just look at it. Just look at that. That's so exciting. So yeah, she's a she's a blank canvas. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we got some moonlighting going in here. There's lighting going in the back here too. I know we're not there yet, and you probably will forget, but I'll tell you, we need to run, also run conduit to one of the footers oh, okay. and the pergola so that we can do lighting in the pergola when that comes about. Can easily do that. Um, yeah, no, I think um, we're good to go. I'll get my paintbrush out, and we'll start painting. Okay. Right there. See the blue puddle? That's supposed to be a pond in the stream. Okay. Blue blob. I'm glad you don't do anything it more. pretty much tells you exactly what needs yeah. done. So that makes sense. We're gonna we're gonna have that thing down there, the pond down there, level with that hike, and then the patio will we'll, be raised. Yeah, above and then it. we'll be standing up there looking down on the pond. I think it's gonna look That'll pretty look wild. Pretty cool. And then this this stream, we're not. I could maybe kick some of these top falls this way, but I, yeah, so we can get some viewing from here. But most of them is gonna be at those windows right Cause there. Cause we do have sitting area over yeah, in here. Yeah, they do. And it would look right to get one or two of them pointed towards this sitting area and this sitting area and the Course driveway. Yeah. And then you'd also have most of them pointed towards those windows when you come in there. Oh, oh. This is gonna be fun. Well, what's going in first, the pond? The, the pond, thing. but we should determine the heights of the patio. So we can go, so, yeah. And then maybe X clear a pad roughly. 
that's patio hikes. And then um, we'll know how high to make these. The, make the berm yep. on the mm -hmm. pond. And we're gonna yeah. be cutting back there pretty good. Cause yeah, patio height is 18 inches above this, this you're saying. Yeah, but you know, if we want pond height, flush of here. That's a lot of digging. back there into that bank big time. And I'm just trying to decide what the pond edges are gonna look like. Uh, I don't know if we can even do that. Cut down so far? That's like two feet. I mean, it's gonna make a massive mound in the back, but it's also gonna give you- yeah, What about all the sides? Extremely high berms. You know what we should have? Man, that would be awesome. What? Tell me. A negative edge out of the pond. Disappearing. Right that would look cool. I'm gonna talk to Barry. Unbelievable. Dude, do you know how awesome that would be? It would, yeah, it's probably a better idea than trying to dig two feet down yes. and having and two would, feet of berm on the sides. Awesome. So here's what we're thinking. If we bring our pot all the way down here, it gains us more height because it all can make super high berm right, all that's right. the way around. That's right. So we were sitting here and we we're like, what if? What if? What if I would take this and just continue that berm and bring pond hike up to patio hike right there yeah. and do a massive negative edge up here? Well, that's not in the budget. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's quite a bit more complicated. It's, it's not, as far as uh, time to Materials, build. no, materials it is. Yeah. You need oh. a pile up. So here's you what you need. Of... Well, you need, so that negative edge yeah, I has to be able to capture, well, I'm explaining to you yeah. how, how big it has to be. It's, it's quite a bit more expensive. Yeah. It has to be, it has to be able to carry the surface water, pond water, times two, mm -hmm. which actually ends it's up being big. quite a bit of water. It's big. Then you're then where there's no skimmer. You're talking about uh, vaults and all that, which is more and like so. Yeah, it's, I love the idea. It's really cool. Hmm. 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 Hold on. Here could be an option. I, I bet we're thinking the same thing. What's this? Well, I was just. I'm, I'm thinking. I'm not saying this is probably going to work either. Eliminate the bog and do biofalls and use that for down here. Now yeah. it's going to be bigger down here than what the bog is, but you can probably flip flop some stuff around and. I think that would be so awesome. It would, it would be, it would bring so a giant waterfall right down to our window. Because if we don't do that, really the best thing to do would be continue this wall. Yeah, that's why I was here. saying it. Yeah, and then um, just build pond height up there. Yeah. Um, Which pond height would be there anyway? We're just negative edge and give you more yeah, feature down here. Yeah, it would be. What were you so excited about? Tell, tell the world. I got my way. Yeah, Ben got We're his way. We're going to be doing an awesome negative edge over there out of the pond. Here's a quick shot of how everything would look before we started building awesomeness. Take a good look. Take a good, good look because things are really going to change around here. I'm just gonna take a moment to say how excited I am about this. This is gonna be so awesome. Might even bring Weston out of the office. Uh, we might, we might. DJ and I were just looking at this this morning. We were like, so we have a patio down here and we're building a new patio that's like 18 inches above that patio. And we're like, where do we build pond hike? Flush with this patio or flush with the patio that's down there? And then we were just scratching our heads and we're like, ah, oh, I know what, let's build it on water hike level with the top patio and then a negative edge out of the pond falling down right in front of that big window a waterfall out of the pond and talked with Derek this morning talked with the homeowner called Tussie Mountain Mulch do we have the product can we do it and everything worked out and in the end Ben gets to build what Ben wants to build and I'm so excited about it such a spoiled kid I know hey that's what he wants. Yeah, I just want to build what I want. He just make it care. work. 